Hey guys, I'm Johnny Scoville and this is Chase the Heat. You know, it's pod season right now, but it's always sauce time. So I thought right now I'd review a really cool sauce. Now, Greg Foster is a good friend of mine. I've known him for years. Um, he's with, he owns Inferno Farms. Made some amazing tinctures of great sauces. If you go back into the history of the, of the channel here, I reviewed a, a lot of his sauces. Got some of them in the fridge right now. But I have this one I'm going to review for you. It's Inferno Farms. Look at the name. I love it. Tingleberry. I think that's really cool. All right, let me read you the ingredients on Tingleberry because the label's kind of small. So I took a picture of it. All right, let's do this. We work with JR Organics in Escondido, California, who supply us with farm fresh, locally grown organic strawberries that dropped a flavor bomb of sweetness into this lofty concoction. Followed quickly by a good dose of heat from the ghost chili, this sauce dangles the promise of pleasure and then the, and pain all in one bite. Ah. Uh, a great blend to highlight the pureness of summer's harvest, pairing it with ominous dose of heat. A unique sauce to, uh, to be sure goes wonderfully with poultry fish tacos, and even on ice cream, it says so. Excuse me. That's somebody purchasing a tube of terror. If you want them, guys, they're still there. And we still have some that are signed. So go to johnnyscoble.com. Um, thank you. Thank you. Uh, only 100% natural ingredients to bring you the best tasting sauce available. Possible, excuse me. We hope you enjoy the the and come back for more. Greg Foster, Sauce Master. Great dude. Really love the guy. He's a good friend. I've spent time with him in a lot of places. All right, let me give you the ingredients of this sauce. All right, Orga uh, organic strawberries from JR Organics. Pineapple juice, sugar, chili pepper, honey, fresh lemon juice, water, white wine vinegar, ginger, garlic, vanilla extract, um, water, alcohol 35%, uh, 35% uh, vanilla bean extra extractives, sea salt, spice, and xanthan gum. All right, they're at Inferno, Far uh, Inferno Farms Hot Sauce.com. Um, I got, I was in uh, New Mexico and, and Greg, I was with Greg there and he had made, um, a tincture that had, I think it was 8 million Scoville heat units. It was in a spray, uh, had a, uh, just a squirt bottle. It got stuck at the tip, and I was trying to squirt it out. It was aimed that way, and I squeezed it, and it went, it just hooked to the left and got me right between the eyes. A blast of 8 million Scoville right between the eyes. To kind of put that in perspective, people, police grade pepper spray is between 2 million and 4 million. Think about that. You see, you watch the videos, you shoot somebody in the face with pepper spray, they're done. I'm used to that. I took eight. Think about that. I'm not a very peaceful, calm guy, but if I, if I got shot in the face with police grade pepper spray, I'd have a lot more fight in me than they'd want me to have. But I'm a peaceful dude. Guys, I'm not ch uh, tainting my sauce. If you go to johnnyscoble.com, you'll see this. Chase the heat. Hot sauce spoon. It's made of mother of pearl, hand carved. Everyone has a unique uh, pattern to it because every shell is different. Um, this is what rich people use when they eat caviar because it doesn't alter the flavor of their food. If you put this on a stainless steel spoon, I do not have one in this house. If you put it on a stainless steel spoon, it affects the aroma and the flavor. You just don't realize it because the second when you're this big, they shove a spoon in your mouth and, you know, after your baby spoon, it's metal. So you're used to it. Try it on a, this spoon, you won't believe it. Ooh. Whew. Wow. Okay, the, uh, the strawberries for sure, you pick up the ghost chilies. The garlic, I think it'll be a hint of the ginger. I know there's vanilla extra, uh, extracts in there, I don't really smell the vanilla. It's neat. All right, I love the color too. The color is beautiful. I don't know if the camera's gonna do it justice. 
One more time. Look at the color of that. I don't know if it's doing it justice. I can't tell. When I look back after, I'll look at it and see. Anyway, here we go. See the pour. My hands are shaking today. Mix it up. Yeah, a little bit. What a beautiful consistency. All right. All right, guys. So from Inferno Farms, my friend Greg Foster. This is his Tingleberry. I'm Johnny Scoville. This is Chicks to Eat. Boy, we're putting the spoon away. You know, another way that you can uh, enjoy your hot sauce without tainting the flavors if you drink it out of the bottle. Wow. Great strawberry flavor. An incredible silky texture. Oh. Now, the, there's still bits and chunky monkeys in there. The flavor is incredible. The texture is incredible. Now, you pick up the ghost chili. Gotta love ghost peppers. Great taste, great burn. Wonderful, what a great pepper. All around, one of my favorites. The garlic and the ginger are beautiful. But what a texture. It's gotta be an ice cream machine. This would be great. Cheesecake. What does he suggest putting up? Poultry fish tacos. Yep. Oh, it'd be so good on pancakes. It'd be so good on waffles. Oh. I'm getting strawberry, little strawberry seeds. Oh. What a delicious sauce this is. It's gonna be so good on ice cream. Now let's talk about the burn on my tongue and not in my throat at all. So funny. All on my tongue. Now, um, it moves my needle for sure. If you're not, let's talk about, not my needle doesn't matter, really. It's your needle that matters. If you've never eaten anything hot, you would find this to be, excuse me. If you never, have you never eaten anything hot, this would be really warm for you. It's a lot hotter than Tabasco, a lot hotter than any of this mainstream stuff you can get. So for a non-chili head, it would be like, Maybe like a seven, maybe an eight. For a non-chili, it would surprise them, you know, if you've never done anything hot. If you chase the heat and uh, you guys are eating hot stuff and you're digging it and it's something you're into, um, six, six out of 10. I don't give flavor ratings because what I like you may not like, what you like I may not. I just tell you what I do like and what I don't like. If I were to give a flavor rating, this would do really well. Mm. I'm a fan of fruit-based sauces. I really am. I get this question asked all the time. Do you, I refrigerate my sauces? Because I've got a lot. A lot of sauces. The only sauces that I refrigerate, I shouldn't say the only, most of the sauces that I refrigerate are fruit-based sauces. fridge. Enjoy later. What a great sauce that was. Tingle, actually, let me show it to you one more time. It was silly. I'll throw, put it in after. Um, if you haven't tried sauces from uh, Inferno Farms, you need to. There's another one I'm, I'm going to be reviewing soon. Illuminati. It's another one that I'll be reviewing very soon. Illuminati. I like the label. I like the name. Um, but right now, if you guys want to go to the description box, this is one I've tried. You'll see a link for Inferno Farms. Click him. He really is a good, good friend of mine. Tell him I sent you. Um, if you get some of his tincture, if he has any available, careful. It's tough in the eyes. It really, really is. Um, thank you for taking the time to, to watch. If you guys want, I, I do have, so, uh, I have a few more of the, the signed ones. I think I told everybody at the time I would do 10. So I think I may have done a few more, but I still have a few signed ones. So if you go to johnnyscoble.com, you can get a signed uh, um, Chase Eats spoon. You guys are awesome for taking the time to hang with me. You guys know that? Appreciate it more than anything. We'll eat more pods soon. 
was going to do a snack for late night snack time, but maybe I'll do a pod. Maybe I'll do a pod any of the snack. We'll see. Right there is our pepper. You know what? If you click that pepper, first of all, I love it when you do that. It shows me that I'm doing something right. Um, we are growing as a family. It's pretty cool. So click that pepper and become part of our family. You'll see a bell for notification. That's a little notification bell, a little icon. Click that bell. A little drop box happens. Click all. You'll miss nothing. Right there is Legal Fire. Legal Fire is awesome. Man, a world ranking for the world's craziest sick chili heads. It's awesome. Men and women around the world. A ranking system, a spotlight, and a forum for the greatest chili heads. It's pretty exciting. So well, click on that. Follow them. More videos. Oh, oh, I love you. I'm Johnny Scoville. This was Chase the Heat.